fun of wrestling. So today I am back at NFW. If you guys watch the panel, we had BRG along with Cody, as you guys seen, and we broke down the match. Uh, it's gonna be really interesting to watch Jack and BRG in this match tonight. Um, someone's gonna die, <laughs> maybe, maybe not. I don't know, social media champion is happening. So but we're giving you a little bit of the backstage feel. They're putting up the ring right now. We're setting up the stream for later. But yeah, so it's a bunch of hours like before, so we're just like, Hanging out, no one's here yet, just uh, production. So. Back with the commentary team as they're preparing really hard. Me, baby on? Yoda. We, we are summoning, on my face. We are summoning the power of Baby Yoda. Sandbike is back. This thing survived? Yes. We Skyros have, didn't punt it to hell? He, he did, but I got him back. I have toys. I got play things for us. Here, we can put it on him. Or we can make him... Oh my god, so I saw like a hat yesterday, or the other day, and I messaged Mike, and it said... Oh, so you're gonna put on said, an hat right It now. said, fuck off. And I really think it should have went up. Or he can have this. Things one. are getting weird here at the commentary table. Things are getting real. Russ is petting. I'm, I, I'm summoning the power of Baby Yoda this evening. Baby Yoda. Baby, baby. But I think that's all the toys. Yes. All right, so we have squids, we have Baby Yoda, and we have Papa Russ. Friday nights are changing forever on television. <laughs> oh, you want to see a sneak peek? OK, actually, here. You hold that, because we're going to unveil it. We are unveiling what I have no idea. The Choke Slam Championship belts. <laughs> Whoa! What is this for? Choke Slam. <laughs> Champion! It's an explanatory. <laughs> well, I'm just doing it on the podcast now. Oh boy. Yeah, well, this the will Choke be Slam Championship is on the line um, this evening. No, not today. Oh. Uh, Shit just got real. <laughs> ah! But yeah, so that's happening. So it's sad, Mike. It's an elf. <laughs> Should we change it? Do you think maybe if we put the mistletoe on sad, Mike? Maybe? <laughs> maybe he'll get some kisses? <laughs> oh, wait, it's gonna be like this then. <laughs> no. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> So you guys excited for tonight? It's going to be, well, it's the biggest night in NFW history. Right. It's the last one of the year. Well, no. Uh, not only is it the last show of the year, but we're crowning our first ever yes. world champion tonight. So um, it's going to be landmark. It's going to be, uh, as, as Gorilla Monsoon said years ago, history is going to be made tonight. Yep. Uh, IWTV, although this is taped, so nobody's going to know. But, um, yeah, so if you are looking for something to watch, look for NFW uh, on, uh, on IWTV and you get to see our first ever world, world champion. It's happening. It's happening. It's gonna happen. Yes. It is happening. We had the social media championship on the line with Jack Tomlinson and BRG. I don't like BRG a single bit. Oh, will you stop whining? No. And he's he's not whining. You know, the, uh, you oh know, my God, man. BRG as an individual needs to learn how to treat people like they're human beings and realize that he's really not any better than anybody else because when you go in the ground, you're in the same dirt that everyone else is. Remember that. And I hope, I hope Jack Tomlinson teaches you the meaning of respect. BRG, listen, BRG is just working business. You should know this by now. Come on. That boy's got an attitude, he, and Jack hey, Tomlinson is going to beat it out. Name something great. Name a great performer who doesn't have an attitude. Exactly. Exactly. Touche. I win. Again. Damn. It's like that. It's like, Bitch. damn. <laughs> I think he's a little upset. I mean, BRG was, you know, on commentary, sat down during... You know, the Jack Thompson and Dante Drago. Well, we are going to have... Here's a, here's a question for you. Oh, 
Oh, I get it. Here's a question for you. What I want to know, can BRG be victorious without those damn Drake brothers? Why is oh, he, he got need, mad? Why they, does he need seven people around him well, at that time? Well, okay. Cody was on the podcast the other day, and he made it very clear that they're not allowed to be in the building today. Ahem. Yeah, I, can, I can sum this up in two words. Sweet victory. Can that stop immediately? I'll do it again. Sweet victory. And he also said he kind of put whoever is going to be the champion on notice that he's coming for the belt. I'm going to tell you what. Here's another question for you. How much of mommy's money has BRG spent on acquiring all of this backup? I can answer this in two words. Sweet (laughs) victory. Uh, Can someone please turn that off? Well, thank you. No more sweet victory. (laughs) Oh, this I didn't mean victory. I didn't mean the camera. I meant the sweet victory. <laughs> <laughs> I am so now that I know that this annoys him. I am going to. Oh no, commentary is going to bring tonight. I'm here for it. BRG Jack Tomlinson is coming for you. Mark my words. No, I'm not. Because See what I, I got to put up I, with I, all I the time. But there's a lot of. There's but, a lot of uh, but I will say this: uh, 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 there's two other matches that I'm really looking forward to, and that is the. Empire State Wrestling Interstate Championship Hell yeah. match. That's gonna be Alec good. Price and Trey Lamar. Mm-hmm. Um, and also, of all matches, it is not a main event match. It's a main event match yeah. every, anywhere. Jordan, Jordan Oliver and... TJ Crawford. And TJ and TJ and TJ Crawford. You, you want to talk about a high stakes contest for both men? Look at look at TJ Crawford. TJ Crawford just back off of that injury. Came up just short trying to become... Uh, trying to move on in the tournament. But... Jordan Oliver too, uh, you know he's he's winning matches here and he's a staple of NFL. Well, actually, well, he hasn't won anything here. He though. hasn't won anything here, as you know. So this, I'm I, I'm looking forward to seeing like who, I don't want to say who wants it, more, mm-hmm. but this could have ripple effects down the road mm-hmm. uh, as for for future titles to, for future title shots. So I'm looking forward to seeing like who comes out on this. And they haven't wrestled each other in four years, so it's completely different than what it was the first time that they wrestled. I'll tell you what, I met Jordan Oliver about four or five years ago at a Wild Zero wrestling event in, Syri- in Syracuse. Totally different person than what he is today. For sure. Completely, com- mm-hmm. completely, completely different. Physically, but physically matured, mentally matured. TJ Crawford, um, I mean, what can't what can't you say about T.J. Crawford? It was it was hor- it was horrible what happened to him over, a little over a, a year ago, but he's come back. He looked he looked great in, in his yep. in, in the in the tournament match. Unfortunately, he came up short. But I'll tell you what, T.J. Crawford, Jordan Oliver is going to be it's going to be it's going to be a classic. Yeah. Yeah, bold statement. The winner of that match, you're looking at the next year to two of who you could see at the very top of NFW, and that's not an understatement. And oh my goodness! And I'll tell you what, Ellis Taylor to me, undefe- only the only undefeated wrestler here in NFW. Will he find a way to get it to the devil? Hi. Devil. How's it going? Right now on We're talking about you. <laughs> Literally. Is your ear ringing? Always. <laughs> <laughs> so, but, uh, but I will, yeah. uh, the only undefeated wrestler performer in NFW, will he be able to maintain that? I mean, because he's, 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 been he's been on a roll. He beat his one of his best friends, <laughs> Jordan Owl, in, in a classic it would match that went on 35 plus minutes for God's sake. So, does he have anything left? I mean, we, we'll have to we'll have to see. But I'll. And that, the Shook Crew's here too. Hell yeah! I'm the Shook Crew, wow. Shook Crew, going oh, up man. again. If you're not watching NFW yet, wasted you. What's your problem? Why not? And yeah. I'll tell you what, wasted you. My boy. Young team. Yep. Newly formed team. Yep. Young kids. Those are the ones you really have to look out for because they're because they're looking up. They have nothing to lose. Yeah. The single success of both of those young men, I'll tell you what, that's what makes those two such a, it's an anticipated duo because both of them have achieved a great level of success on their own. You put that together, mm-hmm. such a wild card too. There's no tape on them together. And it's going you know, to be an interesting showdown to be sure. And NFW's tag team division is developing it's, even as we speak. It's insane. It's, I mean, so, and the tag titles are in the, are in the future for, for somebody. Yep. Um, you can put wasted youth in there, but I think they have to. They have. I don't want to say it's a must win, 
But if they want to really put their stamp on NFW going into next year, yeah. tonight's, a, tonight's a big night. Bobby Jr. Oh, said it's not happening. Ooh. Bobby, well, you know what? Bobby Jr. I don't play in an interview with Bobby Jr. You know what would be great if Bobby Jr. kicked him? Oh, Ooh. will you stop? <laughs> will Maybe you we stop? can put a hat on him. Bobby don't Jr. make me. Oh, so, oh. It's, so we, got a, we got a grudge match tonight. Yes. The Coke Slam Championship. <laughs> Bobby Jr. <laughs> versus Sad Mike. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like but, you know what? But yeah. magic happens. Yes. On television. But I will say this. I mean, the the. Uh, the uh, Tag division. I mean, we've seen teams come in. Yep. You know, and I'll and I'll tell you what. Next year, you know, tag belts are in the future for 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 somebody. Wasted youth. They, I think they have a ways to go. But I will say this: um, there were there are there are team to look out for. Yeah. Right. Oh, and we didn't talk about black and yellow and Miracle Generation. Black and yellow. Black, black and, and yellow. Black and yellow. yellow. This is gonna be a banger. I'm I'll really you, excited for this. I we've been watching Corey Jackson and Ting Chi for a couple for a couple of years. Yeah, now. that's the advantage of being from upstate New York. You see who's and, next before anybody else. You know, and, and I'll tell you what, Corey, they work so well together. Mm -hmm. um, they've been a team for for, for a while. And going up against Miracle Generation, they are, man, I'll tell you what, you're talking about a team that's on the top of something special. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. You know, um, look no further than Dustin Flash Waller and Kylon King. They are taking all of independent wrestling by storm. By storm. I mean, man, it's, they're it, the tag team champions it's up a in uh, Wrestle Open right now. It, it's a tidal wave right now for those guys. Yeah. And, but, I'll, but, but I'll tell you what, Black and Yellow, they're a team that you really can't over, o overlook. No. Not no. at all. They impressed the hell out of me because I knew about them. But I didn't get to see them like in person to the last NFW show, and I was like, "Holy crap!" I was like, "Okay, now I need them in Marvel Generation." So I'm excited that this match is Does happening. Some... This is going to be another like, you know, not a sleeper match. This is something you better be up and alert because you're going to miss a lot during this match. I feel like if you're not familiar with Black and Yellow, it, it really um, the underrated uh, person in that group in that pairing is Tink is Tink Chi. Uh, yeah, so athletic and just so. Yeah, but you say that and then look at Corey Jackson. Corey well. Jackson, I know. Yeah. I mean, that's and you're just getting started. Those guys, they haven't been getting together long either. I know. I, you know, I, yeah. they, every match they, they improve tenfold. And uh, let's just say this: this show is a happening. Uh, when you're watching this, if you haven't seen it, make sure you head over to IWTV, search Northern Federation of Wrestling, and man, that catalog is full. Oh my God. And. Biggest thing of all, watch showcase. This is yes. going to be nuts. Yeah. This is good. The, 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 and one and one other person, I, I I would be remiss if we didn't mention the whisper. Yes. MVP um, of NFW. And of course, and of course, our favorite guy. Oh. Our favorite guy, Mike Skyros. <laughs> He's Hold right on. there. He's right there. Uh, right here. Sad Mike. Right here. Let's, let's start a chant. Um, Moonlight Coward. <laughs> oh, stop it! My God. Moonlight Coward. Moonlight Sad. If you. If you want to look up the the in, in the dictionary of bitter, what do I have to? What do right I have to here, say? he's the one that's ripping up my flags all the time. What do I, I should be, be upset. What, what do I have to be bitter about, though? You, you have, life is great. I have oh nothing to God. be bitter about. Okay, Mike Skyro. There it is, right there. He did the pussy face. You know what? He did the pissy face. You know what? He did the pissy. He's doing it right I'm now. I'm not even saying anything. He's doing it right now. He's doing it right now. You're making me talk about Mike Skyro again. And of course, and, and, and you know what? Two other two. I thought other. we talked about this. We talked about what? I don't what? want to talk about my spirals. Can we talk about something else? Wham! Somebody call the Wambulance. You know what? I'm going to say this. Mike Skyros is an incredibly talented athlete. There you go. And of course, Griffin And I McCoy. appreciate his work very much. Oh, my God. See? It was that so hard? <laughs> there you go. But, that's it. That's but? it. That's all you need to say. That's all. He's, opportun he's opportunistic. Oh, like Howard. Stop it. All right, I'll stop. I'll stop. Okay. Griffin McCoy and Charlie, Charlie Tiger, by yeah. the way. They're and I'll tell you what, them too. Charlie Tiger has probably been the most, I don't want to say surprising, but I'll tell you yeah. what, this kid has so much more to offer. He does. And uh, I'll tell you, look out for big things in the future, in the next couple of years, from Charlie, from Charlie, yeah. from Charlie, from Charlie Tiger. He powerhouse. What a powerhouse! Wrestled the Tiger at 12 years old. His spear, man. And came out victorious. Who does that? Sweet victory. Dude, there is no documented case of that. <laughs> I want to talk about another coward. 
Sweet victory. <laughs> He's like, I'm done. I'm out. <laughs> I win. <laughs> yes. Sweet victory. Sweet victory. <laughs> Santa. Hi, Santa. Ho, ho, ho. I fucking can't. I don't know. Have you been a, a good boy? Have you been a good boy or, or a naughty boy this year? I'd like to think I'm good. What does it say on your list? I don't know if you want to know. Damn it. Discover my secrets. <laughs> well, Santa, are you looking forward for NMW today? Very much so. <laughs> I know. What match do you think is going to steal the show? TJ Crawford, Jordan Olive. Ooh. I think that has a chance to be match of the night and possibly a late match of the year. Today. Who do you think, Santa? I just want to see everybody be good little boys and girls today. Santa? I am. No, you're not. Yes. Yes. Ho, ho, ho. Of course I am. Santa? Well, I believe this. The... You sit on the throne of lies. He's not Santa! He's not Santa! Oh He's God. a fake! Oh my God. He's a fake! So, fake clause. <laughs> Two years ago, December 25th, gave me coal. What's good? <laughs> I have a very good explanation for that. You weren't a good boy. Oh, yeah? Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> really? Yes. This year, though, you might be on the good list. I have to double check. As soon as I get back to the North Pole. I'm going to be on the good list. He's not oh, real. He'll... He's fake. Get him. Get him. Wait a minute. Get him. He smells like beef and cheese. Fake. That's what I have for lunch. Fake. No! <laughs> oh look! We found Santa. Oh. What are you doing here, man? He's going to be enjoying some uh, some, some nice wrestling tonight. Okay. Well, I might need you to watch this. Yeah. Santa, Black, yeah. Hey, you know, Black and yellow and red. Oh yeah. Black and yellow and red. I like it. There you go. You pretty good. Come on. Come on. Hey. 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 Bobby Jr., but I think Bobby Jr. would like this better. I think it looks cute. What do you think, Bobby? Okay, cool. I want a uh, million dollars worth of Chipotle gift cards. I want uh, a toy train, uh, but like big enough so I can put Bobby Jr. on the back and he can like ride the caboose. And I can go like choo choo, and then maybe he can do like a sick trick off it, like a backflip off the train. Um, and I want, uh, uh, that's really it. <laughs> well, Mom, I'll tell you one thing. You've been a very good mom this year. I try. Bobby Jr. has been exceptionally good this year. That's good! I think we can work something out with that. This is why I like you, Kris Kringle. <laughs> ho, ho, ho! And I only have one Christmas wish. I want the Price City OG to be in the White Eagle on New Year's Eve. <laughs> well, I think that is definitely very doable this year. We all know how how naughty Sydney has been this year, so I think that uh, that will be my number one priority. What are you doing here? Christmas is canceled! I'm here because it's magic. Th th there's no magic here in Richfield Park. I don't even see Steve Hoff. What's up, buddy? You're here? How's it going? Oh, right, carry oh, on. Oh. Carry I'm on here, here, pal. You cannot be sad! It's Mike, Santa! Mike, it's Mike, Santa! Mike, Santa. Mike, you cannot Mike, be Mike, sad! Mike, it's Santa! It's Santa! It's Santa. It's Santa. It's Santa. It's Santa. Why are you sad? He brings you Christmas cheer. That is why he's on the sad list. That guy's moody. He's a little grumpy at times. No, he's we're the Grinch. The bus out of him. The Grinch. He is very he's he's the Grinch. Grinch. He really is. He's very moody. Hey, hold on. Hold on. Wait, hold on. Wait a minute. Mr. Santa. Wait, wait. Darren, what's going on? Hi, I'm Darren with Santa. <laughs> and I wanted to ask you what match you're most looking forward to tonight. So many good matches. I'm looking forward to all the ones with all the good little boys on them. Not the ones with the bad little boys. Oh, no, no naughty boys. No. So you want all the good guys to win tonight. That, that's what our, our hope. Of course. 
<laughs> Does he get, uh, is he on the good list? I don't know. Is he on the naughty list? He is most definitely yeah, on the good list. Yeah, I talked to my wife, I'm probably on the list. Hey, you don't smell like Santa. Right. You smell like beef and cheese. You're not Santa. Yeah, you're already mad. I want, That's what I have for you. Don't talk to him, Dante. He's a liar. I want a bridge. How can you live with yourself? You sit on the throne of lies. No, stop stop yelling at Santa! Don't right. tell him what you want. He's a liar. It's okay. Uh, I want uh, a puppy. Stop yelling at Santa! He's not Santa! I heard you have a present. There's one special present that I brought to you. How special? You have been an incredibly good little boy this year. I usually don't, but okay. For NFW, you've been a very good boy. Oh, yeah, yeah, NFW, yes. Yeah. What is this? I have a very special present for you. Is it breathing? It's not breathing. Oh. It's not a puppy. You'll have to wait for Christmas for that one. This is Choke Slam Championship. Wow. It's almost like I was born to wear this. I mean, there's so many great competitors in the Chokeslam division at FW. Trayvon Jordan, Kylon King. But I think it's fitting that there's only one person who deserves to hold this championship. That's the Fred star, Dante Drago. Now, Trayvon, I know that you and I have some beef and you're injured right now, so when you come back, you're the first person challenged for this. But apparently there's an interim champion in Kylon King. Who says he hasn't seen me had a choke slam before and just speak of it? Here he I just want the same thing from Santa as I've always gotten every year from this man. Love, respect, dignity, and care. That's what he's always giving me. One of the easiest people to get things for. That's I it. thought it was going to be old wrestling videos. I have them all. He's gotten them for me already. Okay. So, all, all that is left is love and peace and care in the world. That's all I need. So I guess he's on the good list, right? Most definitely. Is he on the good list? He's on the garbage oh, list. The garbage list is the good list, okay? I've always been on I love the respect of Santa. You know what I mean? A big man's always got a place for the hood. Always got a place for the hood. Look at that. Look at how old he is and he's looking so dapper, so handsome, so clean. Oh my God. 
What's good, Santa? You're my dog. All right, I want Power Ranger Megazords, and I want, I want one of those one wheel. You know what I mean? Oh yeah. All right. You got it. Let's see. It is I, the Choke Slam champion, Dante Drago. You suck. You're not the Captain Neck. I'm the Neck Man, and I am the Choke Slam champion. Shout out to Trayvon Jordan. I'm the new Paul Black now. Well, it's Kylon King. Oh.